important that we address the bottlenecks in every sector for making a leap towards zero hunger. School meal is such an area that has tremendous transformational impact. In the first part of 2020, more children had access to school meals globally than at any time in human history. However, this progress was derailed by the COVID-19 pandemic, supply shocks and shrinking fiscal spaces. As we are recovering from the pandemic, it is important that we redouble our efforts to scale up school feeding programs. Special attention needs to be given to the countries with smaller resource base. Excellencies, school meal program plays a critical role in promoting students' health, academic performance, and overall well-being. They go beyond providing nourishment, acting as a catalyst for positive change in the food system. In developing countries, including LDCs and LLDCs, they have also contributed to reducing the dropout rates from schools. Nepal's experience with school feeding is a success story. It has integrated agriculture, education, food security, nutrition, health and uh, sanitation in the best way. As such, 3.3 million children, including girls, all over the country are directly benefiting every day from the program. We have seen impressive result of school nutrition in boosting enrollment, attendance and learning outcomes. We have quadrupled the budget in the last five years for this purpose. In the current fiscal year, we have allocated 6% of total education budget on school meals. We are committed to further scale up investment and resources for this important safety net. Following the UN Food System Summit in 2021, we organized national and provincial level food system dialogues with relevant stakeholders to examine the existing food system, understand vulnerabilities, and design pathways to transform them. We then prepared Food System Transformation Strategic Plan 2022-2030 to streamline and link the action with sustainable development goals. Nepal also joined the School Meal Coalition in 2021 to improve the quality, adequacy, coverage and sustainability of the School Meals Program. We are also strengthening the capacity of local government to implement and monitor the program. Madam Chair, as we gear up to graduate from LDC by 2026, my government is striving toward establishing a sustainable homegrown school feeding model and expand local food production to ensure a diversified and nutritious food supply to school meals. In doing so, we support small-scale local agriculture development and also help improve the health, nutrition and education of our children. We sincerely appreciate the UN system our development partners and key stakeholders for their strong commitment to assist and transform our food system and achieve SDGs by 2030. Together, let us embrace this transformative journey working hand in hand in to provide our children with nutritious meals, quality education and sustainable future.